President Muhammad Buhari has done well for Nigeria, but I've watched pastors insult him. According to Prophet Igenla, welcome to the news and thank you for turning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. To get notified when we post our juicy news update, please click on the notification bell. The general overseer of Ch Champion Royal Assembly, Prophet Joshua Igenla, in his recent post on YouTube, shared a message to friends and families. While speaking, the cleric reportedly stated that, I want to preach the current regime that will soon hand over the baton to the incoming government in a few weeks from now. On this note, President Muhammad Buhari has done well for Nigeria, but I've watched pastors insult him. I've also seen your imams insult him, but I miss all this. He kept silent. On this note, I want to say that his silence is golden because no clergyman was arrested for a misleading statement against him. Speaking further, he said, and I quote, I want to also use this medium to beseech the incoming government to have tolerance over the clergyman in Nigeria, just the way President Muhammad Buhari has shown. I'm not saying that this gives rise to the clergyman's statement against any leader in Nigeria, meaning that any pastor imam that speaks against the law of the land should be dealt with. Speaking further, he said, As a prophet of God, I am watching, and if I am not seeing the persecution of clergymen when they speak against our leaders, I will speak out. On this note, the incoming government should be sensitive towards the law. They should also see the need to treat the clergy with fairness. Because Bola Ahmed Tenembu's administration will be celebrated if clergymen's rights are protected. Speaking lastly, he said, and I quote, I want to quickly add that if the clergymen go against the rule of law, they should be dealt with. Now, the thing is, um, let's say, Pastor again, let just, everybody will talk about this election, just concluded elections or happenings in Nigeria. Sometimes the first thing I'm going to say is, have they been sleeping all this while? What it make they never come as I contact? But all the same, we go say, ah, thank God say they don't come as I contact, sure. Because had it been they have remained quiet, it would not have been funny. It would not have been funny at all, though. Had it been they kept, they kept quiet till now, you know, would be funny at all, at all. Now, he said he wants to praise the current regime that President Buhari has been quiet in the face of, you know, that's it. But if you ask me, I'm not saying that people should talk against him. But I'm saying, look, even you as a human being, now, 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 as in, as in look yourself. Look yourself, not to go far. You maybe you are just managing your life. You they go your work. Your work, you know, they, you, 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 you want a better work. You want a better job. Or your business self, never they pick. You understand, you they manage yourself. Even you people are talking against you. People will always talk. Not to talk of somebody who is in the number one position, brother. People will talk. That is what I will always tell. See, that's why I'm even telling Tunubu to tie rapper. Make sure your thickness, the thickness of your skin is more than, is thicker than how many mm though. Make sure it is very thick because, whoa, your ear go full. You go hear things where so you say, ah, ah, you go say, when, what? But I'm not like this now. You go hear more. Huh. So I'm not saying it should be applauded. I am saying you should have thick skin because even at, what was it called? Even person will be saying they're in the field, say this person, nothing, nothing, you don't get work, you don't get anything. People, they talk about them. Not to talk about you, will be saying be the number one. You did in the one position where everybody I did. My brother, they will speak about you like this. You will hear things about you. This is not me encouraging, but I'm just saying this is exactly what is going to happen. This is going to happen. And the pastor says something that, eh, uh, Pastor Buhari's silence is good. He did not do anything. In a democratic system of government, people have freedom of speech. Though some people tend to overstep their boundaries. But, but, I beg, make we safe, tone our mouth. Make we tone up. Make we mind as we they talk. I keep saying, um, make we even be careful about spreading fake news. Some people, once they hear news, they don't care. It's true or not true. They don't post them. They don't be the first person to post them for their status. They don't be the first person to post them for their timeline. They don't be the first person to post them for, you know, their Twitter hand. I beg, this this particular administration, make me be very careful. Make me try to they confirm the news before we post them. That is what I'm going to say. Number one, the king coming president should have thick skin. He should have thick skin because even now he's coming as somebody who is frail and fragile. The the dragon will be much. Then we drag this man. Uh, then go so drag this man. So to this man go. This man. This man go tire. I did tell you. This man. He go tire. He go stay here. 
Now like this, now like so. It's not going to be easy. You know, it's not going to be easy for them at all. You know, it's not going to be easy for them. So making day do it in, making day very, very ready. This is not me saying that they should talk against him or before somebody goes say, ah, I'm encouraging it. No. But the thing is, make him get ready. I've said it before. You don't want anybody to talk about you. Remain a medical. Even the medical self, they will talk about you. If you're somebody who you are, you are at a position where you know get, you know one get, you the waste paper person can't give you, no wahala, they will talk about you. We get there for position, we say you get, you they give people, they help people. You are nice. You will still see somebody from somewhere. We come carry them out and say you do this one. You know, be good person, you be wicked person. It they happen. So make a, um, the president say, say let her be a let, making do it and making the prepped because it could happen. All right. They should also see the need to treat the clergy with fairness. He's saying, if all the saying is saying is, is like an advice. He's like he's still saying to the incoming administration that they should not come in and start doing what they call. Uh, what's it called? And starts coming with get simple style. Anybody will talk, you get arrested. He said, make people. We, he came out to say it, it did not mean that people should be talking anyhow. But also, as president, Buhari also get thick skin. Now it's in the talk. Make the incoming administration get thick skin. Nobody said anybody will talk two seconds. They don't carry him. They don't go trace the person go. They don't trace the person go. They don't lock the person up. No. That she trace the clergy with fairness. Huh? They should treat the clergy with fairness. Now, me oh, my own two cents to Tunubu is if you're coming in, just like this clergy talk, number one, you go get his skin. Number two, because you're even fragile. Are they being Tunubu is not in any way fragile? If it's okay, but this one, you're fragile. Ah, They'll not only talk. They are going to do a lot of things that you're not going to. You're not going to like. And you're in a democratic system of government. You must not come and be reading with a... Autocracy or dictated, uh -huh. you will not be an autocrat. Uh -huh. You will also not be a tyrant. Uh -huh. You'll be somebody who is what? you be a president of Nigeria, or not an autocrat, not a dictator, not a tyrant. Now, who you could be? My own two cents, make him be careful. In as much as I tell we Nigerian to ship in our mouth, I know that lots of people are still complaining that they were robbed of their mandate. But in trying to regain the mandate, why the issue is in court, tone down the derogatory term and abuses you use or you met you 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 heap on a particular person. You know either the help. You case the cost. You don't need you don't need to go and start insulting any no 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 no. You don't need to go and start insulting anybody at all. Hmm? If you case the cost, make you do it in. Make yourself calm down. Your case the cost, you calm down. With the while your your candidate they try to get they try to get a mandate back. That's as if they will give a mandate back. You self, you know will come the cause trouble for her. That is my own two cents. Okay on this note we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come you'll be next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.